Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. Using Acrobat, you can easily manipulate entire pages of a PDF. This can be helpful if you want to extract pages from a document, or if you want to replace one page with another in a PDF. For example, extracting pages from a PDF is useful if you want to email somebody just one or two pages from a PDF. To extract pages from a PDF, open a PDF that contains the pages you want to extract, and then use the Page Thumbnails panel to select the page or pages to extract. Click the Options button in the toolbar at the top of the Page Thumbnails panel, and then choose the Extract Pages command from the drop-down menu to open the Extract Pages dialog box. Notice how selecting the thumbnails before opening this dialog box allows the dialog box to automatically select the pages to extract. If needed, you can enter the page range to extract by typing page numbers into the From and To text boxes. Note that the extracted pages must be adjacent within the PDF. You cannot extract non-adjacent pages at one time in Acrobat. Then select what to do with these pages by checking the desired checkbox options. Delete the pages after extracting and extract pages as separate files. If you choose the extract pages as separate files checkbox and then click the OK button, the browse for folder dialog box then launches and prompts you to select a destination folder for the new files. Now if that checkbox is unchecked, then the selected pages will simply be extracted into a new PDF as soon as you click the OK button. To replace pages within a PDF, select the page thumbnails to replace within a PDF by using the page thumbnails panel. Click the Options button in the toolbar at the top of the Page Thumbnails panel, and this time choose the Replace Pages command from the drop-down menu to open the Select File with New Pages dialog box. Use this dialog box to find and select the PDF that contains the pages that you want to use as replacements for the currently selected pages within the PDF. Then click the Open button in the Select File with New Pages dialog box after selecting the PDF to open the Replace Pages dialog box. In the Original section, you can enter the pages in the original PDF to replace by typing a page range into the From and To text boxes. Note that if you had selected the page thumbnails before clicking the Options button, this dialog box will already have the original values filled in for you. Next, enter the pages to use as the new replacement pages by entering that page range into the From and To text boxes in the Replacement section. Then click the OK button. You will then need to click the Yes button in the message box that appears to confirm the replacement. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.